this is Kurt Kohler from the Razor Razor Company. Uh, this is an instructional video on the installation of the containment system onto your leather belt. Very simple. When you receive the belt sword weapon system or uh, the Razor baton, the law enforcement baton, there will be clips that are already installed and in some cases you will not have to add any. However, if you have a sharp sword or a very razor sharp sword, you will want to add extra clips to protect yourself. The uh, process is very simple. Uh, you're going to need two basic things. One, a Phillips head screwdriver. Two, not necessary but advised, a just a simple, short, we call this a stubby uh, flathead uh, screwdriver with a notch in it. And the notch allows you to, uh, as a key, it allows you to work the barrel nuts easier than a standard uh, screwdriver. The, uh, the notch does key is available from Razor Razor. Uh, you'll notice that there's a little machine screw. This goes into the containment clip. And you'll see the access hole that allows you to put it right through. Uh, it's very simple, very easy to, to do. Uh, drop the screw through and turn it. And in many cases you'll hear like a little audible click like that. That means the screw's in. And Put the other one in the other side, like that, and you'll notice the two screws are sticking up. They go into the belt. Uh, what you end up doing, yeah, there are tiny little barrel nuts. And they're called barrel nuts because there's a slight little rise to them. You can see that. And that barrel portion in the center goes into the leather belt and it drops right in. And then what you simply do is you drop this containment clip with the screws right under the back side of the belt and you just drive the screws in and tighten them down. Now, this particular belt, as you can see, has containment clips across the entire belt. Depending upon the size of the sword that you're going to use, or the baton, you may have to adjust this back clip with the stops in it, up or down, and change some of these clips out. There's another configuration that calls the quick draw system. And we have, uh, you can see the, there's uh, skid plates, which are actually uh, number 10 washers. They'll actually come in black. Uh, but just so you can see them, we, we put them in, in silver. There are just three containment clips. The last clip has a stop. And a clip that's split in half that pivots. And as you can see, these pivot. And when the either the razor sword or razor baton is moved, it allows extraction very easily. This is uh, by far the fastest and easiest way to deploy the system. It is literally so fast that when you pull it out people are going to ask where did it come from? There's a third variety and this you'd have to do yourself. These are This is an old belt that I customized and these are containment clips that I simply took a Dremel wheel and cut them in half as you can see and that allows the clips to open up and aids in the deployment. However, this is not nearly as fast as the quick draw system. The quick draw system is definitely faster and of course that's the one with only a couple containment clips. As you can see, skid plates and the pivoting uh, containment clip at the end. The, uh, the, belt, the belt sword is loaded and you'll see other videos from the belt buckle down. The handle is up here, the tip goes towards the tip of the belt. Same with this, and as you can see, there's uh, quite a few containment clips loaded here on this. This would be for typically the, the razor sword that has been sharpened, so you protect yourself from being cut or your clothes from being cut. In this case, just do a quick demonstration here. You'll see we load the system. In this case, I'm using a baton. You drop the baton down. 
into the system. Wrap it. And this is not adjusted perfectly because this is the incorrect size for the adjustment, but it'll still work. And you can see the deployment. Very quick. One of the fastest systems out and uh, certainly is a very formidable tool to be used against an assailant. Should you have any uh, additional questions regarding the uh, assembly process, please give us a call. But again, most of the clips are installed. You may have to adjust the system up or down depending upon the size of your waist, the size of the sword, and, uh, and or raising the time. Thank you.